Today we'll be taking a look at how to set up our new custom workflow screen. Uh, over here at ShopBoss we've created a new uh, customized workflow, kind of a car Kanban system that will allow you to drag and drop and move the vehicles through the process here and define your own custom workflow uh, for your shop. So the first thing we are need to do in order to set this up is to create the categories that we're going to use uh, for each one of these columns down here and the first thing we need to know is how many categories and we're going to go ahead and work with five with ours for right now and so we've got five categories here just called category uh, so now we want to give them a little bit more meaningful name so we're going to call the first one waiting for inspection and we're going to call the next one inspecting the next one we're going to call customer waiting for customer and then we're going to call ordering parts and then we're going to say technician so now it looks like we've kind of run out and we actually need a sixth column here so we'll go ahead and add one more and the last one we're going to call complete so now we've created our categories. Now the thing we need to do is come up with a color for each one of those so they're nice and uh, uh, easy to define and easy to see. So for the very first one, for waiting for inspection, uh, we're going to give that a nice bright pink color around it. And under the inspection column, we're going to give that a little purple hue. And waiting for customer, we'll put that in red. And ordering parts, we'll put that in a green and technician we'll put that in a blue and all done and complete we'll put that in this brownish color here and so now we've defined the colors and the names we want for our workflow and we'll go ahead and click on save workflow and now we're going to go to the actual Kanban card system itself and what you'll see here is all of the categories that you've defined but now we need to take uh, all the vehicles that we have in our work in process and put them into the correct category so these are the uncategorized ones and this column will be added and deleted as necessary depending on whether you have uh, vehicles on the repair orders the work in process screen waiting to be put into your workflow so we'll just take a few of these and drag them over here and we've got the bunch of them that are waiting for inspection and we've got our technicians inspecting two or three of them and then we've got a couple of them where we're customers waiting for uh, waiting to hear from the customer one we're ordering parts two one of them is being worked on and one of them is all complete so now we've gotten all of our uh, all of those moved out of the uh, uh, uncategorized status and so now here's our full-fledged uh, uh, card flow system here and you can see from here, there's a lot that you can do, but we're going to cover that in our next video.